Hey guys, so we went to Once Upon a Child today, got Lily's school stuff, and we got all the clothes she needs, five pairs of pants, one skirt, one matching like hoodie and pants set. We got a sweater, we got tons of stuff, a jean jacket, all these things for like 69 bucks. We spent like next to nothing to get all this stuff, four books. Just so many items, just so much for $69. You can't even go into a department store for that price. Not even Kohl's has prices like they do. But that's not what this video is about. This video is about someone who is so inconsiderate and annoying. This is what annoys me about people. You go into places, they have one fitting room. You know they have one fitting room, and this fitting room has a sign that says six items or less is allowed in there. This woman has a basket in there, and I could clearly see that there's a lot of clothes and stuff everywhere. So I'm thinking she has more than one child in there. And I'm thinking, okay, six items per kid. There's probably like three kids. So this is why there's a lot of items in there. Woman opens door finally after like 10 minutes being a bitch in there, and her kid's trying on clothes. I'm like waiting, and I only have six items that my kid has to be tried on because I, I can read, and I, I'm not going to bring more than that in there. So. She opens the door, one kid, one, one kid, she only has one kid, and there's hangers everywhere. This woman's a mess, and, I, and, and so I'm like, okay, calm down. And, I, and as I'm going in there, I'm like, wow, people can't read, and I'm trying to be like really loud so this woman can hear me, you know, so she, so she maybe can, can get it through her head that she needs to read a sign, and next time don't do that crap because that is, that is ignorant and annoying when, when people can't, can't read a sign. And do what the sign says. I guess there's, it's not just reading, it's comprehending and actually putting forth, being a good human being and listening. She needs to go back to school. <laughs> and woman is way older than me. She's like probably like 40. I want to say she's like 35 or 40. Okay, that's what she looks like. So obviously she should have had acquired some respect and etiquette in her life, but apparently not. Um, <laughs> So we are done trying on clothes. Lily can't fit these two pairs of pants, so I'm like, let's go replace them with something else. And so we go back to the aisle. And who is there sitting in the middle of the floor? Stupid fitting room woman. Stupid fitting room woman is sitting in the middle of the aisle, hangers everywhere, shirts everywhere. It's a mess. Okay, this woman is a clearly clearly not been brought up right or or anything and doesn't know etiquette or common courtesy because you're sitting in the middle of an aisle that is small okay you're sitting in the middle of the aisle woman you are rude you are inconsiderate and I don't think you'll ever see this video but I had to post it for other people who do this crap okay what I should have done and what I wanted to do and my instincts were like you should do it but then my 25 year old self goes don't because you know people like that will get theirs eventually you don't need to be the one to do it because you have your child with you it's going to make you look really horrible amongst everyone else so I didn't go up to her and say move your ass you stupid bitch you know you can't read so Obviously, that's why you went into the dressing room for like a hundred hours, try on clothes, you know, and that, 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 you know, that, this is obviously the type of person you are and the type of person your child is going to become is someone who is inconsiderate and disrespectful. And I feel bad for that child to have a mother like that because, you know, when, when she grows up, if she hasn't realized that now her mom is really inconsiderate and people are going to be talking about her mom and how inconsiderate she is and some people are going to confront her and then there's going to be heated arguments and stuff and I really feel bad for that kid because it's not her fault that her mother is stupid. So anyway, you guys, let me know in the comments below what annoys you when you go into a Goodwill or a consignment shop because that pisses me off. I just hate people. I hate that woman. I wanted to smack her in her face. Alright, bye you guys. See you later. Oh crap, can't turn this off.